on trend for a little while with these trousers. <laughs> ah. And from pink to yellow, because that's the colour of the warning that's in place at the moment. The Met Office warning for heavy rain. This afternoon, we could see a further 10 to 30 millimetres of rainfall on top of what we've already had. So we keep the risk of flooding. In some places, we've already got a lot of surface water and saturated ground. And this afternoon, as this rain sinks southeastwards, it could produce a rumble of thunder too. Top temperatures of around 20 or 21 degrees Celsius, may even see 22 where we get some sunshine ahead of that main band of rain. And it's windy, those uh, southwest is gusting around 35 to 45 miles per hour. Can't rule out something a bit stronger at times. But this evening, the last of that rain should clear away to the southeast. And then we're left with slightly lighter winds and a lot of clear sky. And that means it's going to be a much colder night than last night. We're looking at lows of around five to seven degrees Celsius with the winds returning to the northwest. And those northwesterly winds are going to be dragging in this much colder air for Saturday and the weekend. So chilly old start to the day but a lot of saturday sunshine on the cards but also those northwesterly winds dragging in one or two showers but for most of us it will be dry top temperatures if i can call them that of 12 to 14 degrees celsius but feeling even colder in those northwesterly winds tomorrow which will be lighter than today but could still gust between about 25 and 30 miles an hour at times and then on sunday the winds continue to ease down a bit gusts of around 20 to 30 miles an hour on sunday a lot of sunshine but temperatures for many of us struggling to get into double figures we may on sunday just have a bit of thicker cloud in norfolk and there the risk of an odd shower and then monday through to wednesday fine and dry